Today we are in... What's going on everyone? Welcome back. Today we are at Accolade Homes of Calhan here in Calhan, Colorado. And we are getting ready to check out this beautiful Bella Vista floor plan. So let me get you outside and I will tell you all about it. All right, so this is the Sequoia. Look at it, it is absolutely beautiful on the exterior. The rendering actually shows it over here with a garage, which is really cool. I think it looks fantastic, a little bit different. Uh, I might leave that for you over on timothyplivingston.com as far as our blog post on this home. But as we're going to be touring it today, this is a three bedroom, two bath. It's approximately 2,255 square feet. So you do have several different things going on. You got these nice gables going all the way down the home. And then you got this fun kind of different accent. You got the board and batten right here. Nice yellow color up against this red. Shoot, this is almost like it's like my channel colors. Like if I was a home, this would be it. But you do have nice white trim around all of your windows. And then this is your front door right here. And your master sits up towards this side of the home. Ro was in there giving us a little bit of a, a sneak peek. Um, I, don't, I don't know if you guys caught any of it or not. But anyway, coming around to the side, this one isn't quite all the way trimmed out uh, or have the siding on this side. And you'll see that on the inside, but definitely a beautiful home and once it is trimmed out you have yourself a winner and then coming around to the back side over here you do have several more windows you got this one right here coming out of the master bathroom and then you've got your kitchen sliding glass door into the dining room and these three lovely windows coming out of your living room and if you do really like this home and you're interested in finding it i'll leave that information for you in the description as well as over at timothyplivingston.com where i'll let you know where what states this home is available in and all that type of stuff. Uh, so definitely go check that out. We'll get around to the side over here. Like I said, I think this one will look really good uh, with this garage. I might put the go over to the website. I'll put a picture up uh, of the rendering, but it would come right off of this door right here out of the utility room. But without further ado, let's get up onto the... Uh, I guess this one doesn't have a porch, but let's get up to the front of the home and go inside. All right, so when you first walk into this home, this is the view that you were greeted with. It's got this fun little foyer right here, little cutouts. We do have a couple special guests today. Ro and Jen made it to Colorado with us, so super excited. Hi. Say hi. Say hi. Y'all, he did so good on the flight. Like, he slept the whole time. Super proud of him. But anyway, uh, you have this cool little box area uh, that acts as your foyer. You got your doorway right there, and then you have this fun little window and then from there that opens up into this beautiful living room you got the nice dark tray ceiling up here great big windows and then of course we've got the fireplace lovely tile surround nice wood mantle up here digging that kind of a raised hearth too so you can put some decorations on either side I think that would look really good and then you have these nice built-ins we got some cabinets underneath and then from the living room it opens up into this gorgeous kitchen and this part right here i love it this range hood is something special we'll go ahead and do this real quick so nice tile backsplash here too pretty close to matching behind the fireplace and then you have some cabinets on either side and then you have some pot and pan drawers down below that your oven, built-in microwave, and then panning you around into the rest of the kitchen, you do have this fun island right here. You got the raised bar, and you could definitely one, two, three, four, five, maybe six stools on this side. And then coming around inside of the kitchen, you do have a prep sink in here with more counter space, plenty of outlets as well. So you know you can get all those crock pots going. Nice big pot and pan drawer. And then on the opposite side, you've got your refrigerator, large amounts of cabinet space, stainless sink, huge windows. Let's see, can we get any mountains? No, I think we're still part of, you know, we're, we're still more on the front range, but dishwasher right here. And then in between both your um, 
cook surface and your sink is this nice large corner pantry. It's got the wood shelves in here. A lot of these have really had um, the wood shelves, which you know we're always looking for. You, I get so many comments about the wire shelving. It's ridiculous. So it's nice to see a home that has some wood shelves in there for you guys. Into the dining room, cute dining room. I like the table right here. Got your sliding glass door behind it. Get you a cool light fixture hanging down over the top of your table. I think that would look really good. And then there is some space over here off to the left. And then moving into the second living room. This is more of a den area. You do have that archway. Nice big space in here too. Kind of like a fun, I guess it could be like a little TV room or something. But that fireplace, I mean, I'd be in there. I'd put the TV over the top of it. That's, that'd be where I was at. All right, so this home isn't quite finished being trimmed out, but that is fine. I didn't want to miss it, but you understand it'll be finished up once it gets to your location. But into the first of the mini bedrooms in this home, this one sits up towards the front. Again, great big windows in there. And, oh, look at this. How about this for a closet in a secondary bedroom? Wood shelves, wood dowels, very big. All right, so this one does sit right off of this den area, but then we start working our way down a hallway. You do have like a linen closet right here. And then next to that, you go into the second bedroom. And I think that's all that sits on this side of the home. The master bedroom actually sits on the opposite side of the home. You do have big windows in here also. And then this closet is the exact same as the other one. This one might even be a little bit bigger. Very nice. Let me uh, know what you think about all these Colorado homes down in the comments. I don't know how many you've seen yet, but let me know about them. Into your first full bathroom, you got a single vanity right here. You would have, of course, a mirror back behind it, um, but plenty of counter space. You've got your toilet and then a nice shower and tub combo. And then backing out of there, all the way at the end of the hall, you do have your side door right here attic access up above us and then that opens up into the utility room so you've got washer dryer hookups right here and then you've got like a hanging dowel over the top of it behind this door plenty more cabinets folding space wash basin and you got this window right here and oh my these closets are huge. And then into the furnace closet. All right, and then back across the house, we will go into the master bedroom, which sits just to the right of the foyer, kind of towards the end of the home, but also sits up towards the front of the home. You got this great big window and then three transom windows uh, at the back. It's got this fun little bulkhead with some accent lights up underneath of it. A little, little different, but great big room in here. And then right off of that, you come into the ensuite. Plenty of cabinets right here. And then you have a single vanity on this side with your mirror. And then there's some lights above it. And then on the opposite side of the bathroom, you have another single vanity. So that's nice because you kind of have personal space and you're not right up next to each other. And then in the middle, you do have this beautiful tub. And then I'll, there's a shower, it's kind of back behind us. So you have a closet in here. I haven't been in any of these, uh, behind any of these doors. So I have no idea. I know one of them's gonna have a toilet. And then this corner one, there's another closet. 
Again, nice size with the wood shelves. And then as we're turning around, you do have a standalone shower right here with the tile going all the way up to the ceiling. And you got a nice little cutout uh, in the back. And then that would make this door the water closet. All right, so let me know what you think about this home down in the comments. If you want any more information on this model or accolade of Calhan, I'll leave that information for you in the description, as well as over at timothyplivingston.com, where you can search for this floor plan, as well as all the floor plans that we tour across the country, and you can see if they're built in your area. As far as the price of this home, it starts at approximately $257,000. Of course, that may or may not be the price that you pay if you decide to make this home yours. I am not a salesman, nor affiliated with any of the homes that I show here on the channel. Simply here for inspiration, entertainment, and information purposes only. But with that being said, my name's Timothy. He's off to go see the shower. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next one.